On this video, I'm going to show you how to connect the Uniview cameras using an external PoE switch, as well as utilizing the built-in PoE ports on the MBR. This is how a typical setup will be. Let's begin. Right here, we got four IP cameras. The first two IP cameras, I have two Ethernet cables that go directly into the MBR. The MBR has built-in PoE ports. To set up these cameras, you just simply plug them into the PoE ports and the MBR will automatically set up and configure the cameras. Now, for the other two cameras, I have them connected into the external PoE switch. So I have here the two cables for the two cameras connected into the PoE switch. As you see, there is another connector right here, it's called the uplink. The uplink connector, it is connected to the router. In this case, it could be your home router or your business network. And then I have another cable from the router that goes directly into the MBR LAN interface. And that is how you connect the IP cameras using built-in PoE and also using the external PoE switch. Once again, built-in PoE ports directly to the IP cameras and then the other IP cameras that go to the external PoE switch the PoE switch, the uplink connector into the router. And then from the router to the LAN port of the MBR. Now let's go over the configuration to add the two cameras that are connected to the external PoE switch. Let's begin. To add the other two IP cameras, you simply right click to get the menu and click on menu. Then type in the default password, 123456. And the username is admin. It will ask you to change the default password. If you want, you can do that, but we're not gonna do that in this video. Let's just select no. Now inside the menu, you are going to go under camera. And as you see right now, the first two IP cameras if you click on the configure icon, it is plug and play. Second one is plug and play. The third one is plug and play. And the fourth one is plug and play. The MBR automatically find the other IP cameras. The IP cameras by default, they are on DHCP. Meaning when you connect them to your local network, they grab an IP address automatically from the router. Now, in order for us to add these two cameras into the other two channels, we select the configure icon and then select manual and just click on the camera that you like. Let's say IP address 100. The default username is admin, the password is 123456 and just click OK. Now let's add the last one click on the configure icon once more select manual and then select the last camera it will tell you right here in the status that you already added the other cameras so you cannot add the same IP camera so let's just click in the IP address 101 same username and password admin 123456 and just select OK if you would like to remove the camera Simply click and configure once more and then select plug and play. Once you click OK, the camera goes back into the list of cameras that hasn't been added. If you would like to change the IP address, you can scroll to the right and then click on the advanced icon. Then you could change the IP address directly to the IP camera and provide the IP address you desire. After you fill up this information, then you can just select apply 
and exit. Now that all cameras come up, that's it. You just finished how to install and configure and set up the IP cameras using the external PoE switch and the built-in PoE ports in the Uniview MBR.